we have also to measure the two nautical miles CPA that uh, we required. So two nautical two nautical miles. So from MX going to uh, two nautical miles. Because the vessel uh, will pass ahead, so that's why we are uh, going to uh, connect the, M the MX in this side. So from MX to uh, 2 nautical miles. So this will be our new RML. So we have now the new RML. Then... Uh, bring it to the center okay so our uh, new rml is 280 degrees so we have now the uh, new rml so in order to get the speed of a uh, new rml so, new RML speed is equals to distance over time. So, in order to get the distance, you have to measure from uh, <clears throat> R1. Or the or the R prime, but uh, before that, we are going to get first the R prime or the R one or the R prime. Okay, from the RML and RML. Okay, from the in RML. You have to connect it to M. You have to connect the new R in RML to M. Okay. So after you connect the new in RML to M, from E to R, from E to R, you have to pivot the divider, then it connects, it connects here, so this will be our R1 or R prime, this will be the R prime. Then R prime to E. So we have to connect the R prime to to E. So we already connect the R prime to E. So E to R prime, E to R prime, this will be your true motion or the course to alter. So let's bring this to the center. So, you will have now the new course to alter of 0, 6, 3 degrees. So, the new course to alter is 0, 
0.63 degrees. 0.63 degrees the new course to alter. By the way, your uh, new NRMN, uh, just uh, bring this to the center. So you will have a uh, 280 degrees. Then we have to get also the speed of the new NRML. So to get the speed of a new NRML, speed is equal to distance over time. So in order to get the distance of a new R new new uh, RML, you have to measure from R1 to M. So, from R1, R prime to M. So, you'll have a 2.2. So, 2.2 divided by your uh, time of 0 0.1. So you'll have a speed of 22 knots. So a uh, new RML speed is 22 knots. Okay guys, so You'll have already the uh, new course to alter, which is uh, 060 de 063 de degrees. And the uh, new NRML is 280 degrees. By the way, we have a new NRML. As you can see, as you can see, the old uh, RML is not as satisfactory. Uh, it has a zero CPA. That's why we are creating a new NRML to have a two nautical miles CPA. And the new course to alter is 0 0.63 degrees. So uh, that's all now guys. And then uh, see you on the next video.